The new guide layout feature in Photoshop allows users to easily create custom grid layouts with precise control over rows, columns, and margins. It provides a dialog box where you can specify the number of rows and columns, the width of gutters between them, and optional margins around the edges of the canvas. This feature is particularly useful for designing web layouts, print materials, or any project that requires consistent spacing and alignment. It is a more flexible and efficient alternative to manually adding guides. Let's take a look at this feature in action. To get started, we go to View, Guides, New Guide Layout, and open up the New Guide Layout dialog box. You can see that we're presented with various options. And there are some presets that you can use to get started. An eight column layout, 12 column layout, 16, 24. But for this example, we're gonna create our own custom layout. So I'll do three columns with a gutter of 32 pixels. Turn on the margin, and I'm going to add a 32 pixel margin around the outside edges, and click OK. So now that we have this set up, we can easily turn on snapping, and we can draw elements into the layout and quickly align them to the guidelines that we have set up. So I'll draw three rectangles and place them into the canvas and they're quickly and easily aligned with the guides that we created with the new guide layout. Now that we have our layout set up, we can actually turn the guides off by going to View, Show, Guides. We can quickly toggle this off by using Control or Command semicolon on the keyboard. And that's a quick demonstration on how you use the new guide layout inside of Photoshop.